Okay, we're back. I'm sorry about the short story about the episode being so short because I just wanted them to try and make it a complete LP. Like having a zero in a second in, in the ones column of the digits. In the last episode in the last episode we transported well, we transported ourselves to a mysterious house. They have no idea what we're supposed to be doing at. Here we go. This photograph. Sit down. There we go. That's how we, that's what we're supposed to be doing. And the computer turned on by itself. Now we put the flash drive in. Let's see, apparently his his phone Apparently his phone number apparently the password is his phone. There's a nice little area here, maybe you can check it out. This is his bathroom probably. There's something there's something here. Is this the nice little area here? <laughs> yeah, this is the bathroom. Let's see, I need I need a phone I need that. <laughs> I cannot, I can, I, I cannot tell what the buttons are. Is that a smoke alarm? Oh, it's, oh, they're a mountain, they're a mountain of cigarette buds. <sighs> Let's see, so that's one too. Oh, that's, I like, that's not gonna work. That contact this, no. Just just press it out, card, 9937854862. Let's see. Nine, nine, no, nine, nine, three, seven, five, two, no, seven, five, four, six, eight, four, and two. It's so, it's such a hard password. Let me read the file, let me read it again. So that was card. Nine three eight eight six two. Okay, now I can't remember. Let's see now. Nine nine four eight six two. Yeah, baby. It's too, I'm too deep in my research, the, I can, I'll read this still. I'm too deep in my research as a web page. I ended up inside the Monomic Biz, but I can't, but I can't get, but I cannot give up. I'm still set, scoring for clues. For clues, as if I'm prepared to write another article, an article that nobody will read. I can't help myself, though. I want to organize my data before I perish. If somebody reads these notes and manages to escape from here, that, that would make everything worthwhile. A salon worker, a, ho a hotel employee, an internet cafe customer, three high school girls, and a doll maker. The only connection between them is that is that they all sell the black page. Thus, I must conclude that the black page is what brings the people here. With regard to the, with the multiple deaths that, uh, the, at the Crimea at the hospital five years ago, it seems that all the victims were somehow connected to Rekha Asagiri. Most of the victims were completely people like familiar with her, but, it, but it's also interesting that this d continued even after her death. Her suicide was most likely the event that started it all. Locations within the, the, the Monica Abyss seem to be composed on the memories of, of the people trapped within. I confirm that new locations emerged out of my arrival. When you first arrive, you are somewhat alive. Your memories are intact in your body, and reality is, pro is properly a comatose state. As you come in contact with the ghost, you slowly become yourself. You slowly become a ghost yourself. When the transformation is complete, you most likely you, you most likely die in real life. If I could. Find a way to get out of the monogamous world. My body is still alive. I would probably be able to return to the real world. However, I'm not. I've yet to find any such method. Now let's talk about Rikos the Yuri again. This all, this is all conje conjecture from here. Although, according to the nurse's diary, Rico, com Rico committed suicide when she lost her will to live. Anger at her mother and her, and her tribal friends, of friends of her abandoning her spirit on, on her own. The black page seems to be a manifestation of her rage and loneliness. One can one can also almost sense her anger and fear by being betrayed. That is probably what le led to the initial incident at the hospital. The expansion of the Malakabis could represent a little zero's desire to escape at the hospital at any cost. So how are we to combat this? 
I don't have the answer to that. However, I did find a short memory when I, when I transported to Yoko Asagiri's room. It was her daughter's phone number. C ghosts would communicate will communicate with you with the phone. Perhaps you can communicate with them the same way. Perhaps you can persuade them. That the, that's the only thing I can come up with, with, with in the time that I've left. 997-660-184. Wait, this is Michael Asagiri's cell phone number. <laughs> ah! I didn't think that was going to happen. Fine, just said, I had to get the last lap, didn't you? Ah, there he is! So now, I knew that you would get here eventually. I just followed you here, Sadao. I followed your research, too. I think I understand it now. But what are you trying to tell me through your notes? I just wanted to show you what I was researching. That's all. What do you mean? Transcendentists don't have the power to change events or solve issues. Yeah, I've discussed this with you many times, but we can spread the news about a particular topic, and that can lead to change. That's what you always say. Yes, that is what I believe. As a journalist, I have to believe that. I'm glad you were able to come this far, Makoto. I'm glad I was too. Is there nothing we can do? Is there no way to stop Reiko and the expansion of the mnemonic abyss? No. Well, perhaps there is a way. But those things are not important anymore. Sudo? Oh no, no, no. Don't tell me he's gonna do what I think he's gonna do. Wait, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't do it to the hell, no! Holy fuck. Oh my god. No, Makoto's dead. The curse completed, and that's gonna end this video, ladies and, and I'm gonna end it here, ladies and gentlemen. Um, <sighs> such a tra this is such a tragic thing to see death. See you guys later as you as we join as you join me later for the finale.